I like it. You look. I like this white wall. Of course, it looks great. <laughs> okay, hey everybody. Hey everyone. We're trying Whoosh. out a new thing. Uh, yeah, we are in the infinite whiteness. We're in the future. Come to the future, with <laughs> Annalie and Jesse. Today we went to the Wild Fox sample sale oh my in downtown Los it's Angeles. It's not the sample sale, it's the warehouse sale. Oh sorry, the warehouse sample mm -hmm. sale, which is their big one year thing where they get rid of everything. So A lot of things, not everything. Everything! Well, I guess, because I got like a pre-fall, so, or stuff that's not even out yet. Yeah. But I think that was a mistake, but whatever. No, well it's a sample sale, so that what that means, so, as some of you guys might know, um, that word is thrown around a lot, but a real sample sale is when designers sell the items of clothing that are in their showrooms and used on photo shoots. But I mean, obviously there was a lot of stuff in that sale that was just probably in their warehouse sitting around um, that on hadn't been that. sold. Yeah. yeah, so they're just kind of clearing inventory, but for real sample sale stuff, because I know there's stuff that we saw from the photo shoots that were there. So. Yeah, that aren't even released yet. Yeah, so yeah. they're one-off pieces, stuff like that. Real sample sales are when they sell kind of rare things that nobody gets to get. So Sorry. let's get, <laughs> let's go. we're gonna have the Wild Fox sample sale and then Anna has a small Sephora haul. Yes. Okay, and then Mookie has a small haul. Yeah. Check out that at the end. I don't know how that's gonna work when we record it, but we're gonna give it a try. Yeah. So. <laughs> All right, ready? Okay, cool. To your first okay, item. Okay, so when you guys go to a sample sale or like a warehouse sale, you have to be able to have that mentality that you're gonna have to like dig. Mm. Most of the stuff were in boxes. If you checked out our vlog that we posted right before this, you'll kind of get like a little sneak peek of what yeah. how it was when we walked in. Yeah, um, I didn't record too much because there were girls getting, getting naked, naked everywhere. So you want to respect everyone too because yeah. people, there's no dressing rooms. So for you girls, make sure you dress nice. Um, my advice is when you go to a sample sale, wear like a tank top and wear like shorts or like leggings just so you can actually put it on and put it off and without worrying about having to take your t-shirt off, being half naked and like, you know. Or completely naked. Or completely like some naked, girls naked and some, which some girls were, you know. That's crazy. Yeah, so we didn't record too much of that because mm -hmm. that's just It was rude. boobs and butt <laughs> everywhere. So. Yeah, so. All right, so your first item. The first shirt is Daredevil. It's a loose flowy shirt. I got it in a size medium because I wanted it a little bit more loose. The greatest thing about Wild Fox is like their shirts are super soft. Mm -hmm. So if you're you're very much into like how a shirt feels, like you kind of like it where it's already um, lived in. Yeah. The more you wear it, the better it gets. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the next shirt that I got is this. This one's for Anna. Yeah. I mean. Totally me. <laughs> Everything I got basically is like a yeah, little has bit of to do with you, yeah. Yeah, these are the v low V-necks, and it's a little bit longer too. So. You see, the Wild Fox T-shirts <coughs> are cut on the bottom. They have a kind of like tails on the side, so they're kind of more flattering for girls. <laughs> I've wanted this for a while, and I always forget about it. It's a tank top. Yeah, it's a little bit big, but I wanted it, and I didn't really want to dig through it. Once I saw it, I was like, oh, it's there. Yeah, I'll just take it. Um, but it says, I need coffee, which yep. I really do need. Always. Speaking of. <laughs> and it's uh, low low cut on the sides. Low cut on the sides, yeah. Oh, that doesn't really show it. And it's raw, raw edges and low cut on the sides. Yeah. So, one of those drapey shirts that you show your bra with, right? Yep. All right. The next one. Ah, uh, this is awesome. This is a score. This is a major score because it's not even released yet. But it's a shirt that's, it's, well, no, it's like a fleece. It's so soft. It's not a yeah. t-shirt. What would you it's say It's like this a is? super thin uh, sweatshirt material, but, but it's, it's more so like, thin. it's not, no, it's a knit. It is a knit. Yeah. It's a very fine knit. It's a very, this is a very expensively made shirt. Yeah. So. And it says Tokyo. Yay. Um, so that's a little hint on what, uh, <laughs> one of the photo shoots that we, that has not been released yet. Yep. That will be released. Which is awesome. Which that's is awesome. Yeah. Here's the next piece. A uh, cute little pair of booty shorts. Yeah. And what size is that? I got that in, in a small. Yeah. Yeah. Their shirts and their, well, their shorts are pretty true to size. Well, they're, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Their shorts and pants are pretty much true to size. Their shirts are a little bit more overflowy, so I always suggest maybe going a, maybe one size smaller um, or just try it on before you get it because it all depends on how you want it to fit and flow on your body. Yep. Yeah. So those nice. Are cute. Those are cute. The next item is this. I'm excited for this. It's just a low flowy like knit, um, I guess, I don't know, like a tunic. 
Again, it might be more of a cover up, like mm -hmm. a bikini cover up. But I'm gonna, I plan on wearing this with shorts. You know, um, it's very large, so I got it in extra small. And then what else? That's about it. Yeah. There was another it's one cute. that I wanted where it was like cream and had the actual in black writing and says salty hair, which I've wanted for quite some time because it was just like a little saying. Yeah. Um, but it was a size large. You're I right. fought the urge of like purchasing it Too just much. to purchase yeah. it. But it was cute. I've wanted one of those shirts, the salty hair, beachy hair. Yeah, mm. it was cute. But. You win some, you lose some at sales like that. Yeah. So, so this is my pick. I found it, so yay for me. And uh, here we go. It's a reversible blue star bikini. Yeah. And it's so string it's bikini. Hello. And if you, I'll reverse mine because you can, I can reverse mine yeah. easily. Well, these are you could just show. So you, I could wear it white. Or you can wear it white and the or butt says wild box. You could actually mix match it too if you wanted yeah. to. Oh, you could. You could yeah. do white on top. Ooh, so yeah. clever. Yeah. Yeah. These were awesome. Um, major deal on these. I've wanted yep. some Wild Fox swimwear, but never got them. I don't know why I didn't. Yeah. The designer of these, her name is Leilani. Um, she She's is awesome. amazing. Yeah. yeah. She is Everyone if, at Wild Fox is amazing. If you guys happen to know who Shrampton the Cat is, that's his mama. That's his mama. Yeah. yeah. If you don't know who Shrampton the Cat is, check him out. Yeah. Make sure yeah. you follow him on Instagram. He's yep. like a cat sensation. Yeah. <laughs> and, and then, then next the next one is... You do the bottoms, I'll do the top. It's Jeez. another reversible one. So cute! I love these. And then we shot this. When, this was from the Hello Charlie uh, line. Yep. When we did the photo shoot. Um, so what was that? Like maybe last a season ago? I think so. Two seasons. Yep. Yeah, I think. I don't know. I get. I'm so like mm. bad with like with but everything because we shoot everything like two seasons out. Mm -hmm. um, but this is from the Hello Charlie. Uh, Charlie's aim. Oh. Wild Fox Angels or yeah. something like that um, shoot or campaign, but yeah. I'm and excited. the cute thing about the Wild Fox bikinis is they have these little the, gold all about hearts. the little details. Yeah, on, yeah, on then, the end of all the strings, little gold hearts. Yeah, and with the W with the Wild Fox logo embossed in it. Yep. And same thing with this; it's reversible. You can Super show it cute. off with like where it shows what. Oh, this one doesn't show. No, it doesn't oh, have. Then never mind. Yeah. So let's. See. But it's still reversible. Oh no, it does. Look, see. Wow. Oh, it has a little running there. Yeah. Okay. Um, and those are those are really cute. They're really well made bikinis. So yeah. I can't wait to get Anna in them <laughs> in Vegas. So. Yeah. And then we, the we last. We have a lot thing, of trips happening we this summer, so keep an eye out for keep that. Um, and the last thing I picked up because I I know I've seen this and I really like it. It is an enormous towel. It is probably eight feet by four foot. Yeah. I'm not kidding. It's huge. Look, yeah. See that? We use that for a lot of the shoots. Yeah. Um, so it's great for going to the beach. Not that we do that a lot. I'm honestly going to use it for Mookie. I'm going to have him put for it the car, right? in the car for when he goes on car rides. So, because it's just a huge ass towel. So that's what he's, he's yeah. getting his own wild fox towel. So good for Mookie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah uh, the, the, and then if we do actually do go to the beach, I'll just wash it and we can use it. So wild fox is an amazing brand. They have, I think, I don't even know. And this is not sponsored, guys. It's not sponsored. We're just like, you know, we work for them um, on shoots and stuff like that. And we just think they're rad people. So. Yeah. And we like their stuff. So. Yeah. So we support our friends. Yeah, so. totally. Uh, the next thing we're going to show you is from Sephora. And it's a quick, 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 quick call. But I thought you guys always want to know what I get there. So I'm going to show you. The first item I'm going to show you is this. It's a Givenchy lip liner in number three. I have it already. I'm actually just refilling it. Um, I love it. It's really the same tone as the lips that I have right now. La Vanilla deodorant in vanilla. We've never tried it, but I wanted to try it because we do like La Vanilla. The next item we're going to show you is this. It's a La Vanilla rollerball. We're restocking this. Both of us use it. We love it. It's very clean and just doesn't smell too perfumey. Like it's more of like that essential oil smell, which we both like. The next item is this. We actually went to Sephora to pick up a new foundation and I wanted to get my Givenchy, which I always use, the Eclat Matissimi. Mm -hmm. But when once I was there, I wanted, I was like, oh, let's just try a new one, you know? And I've always wanted to try Giorgio Armani, so I got color matched by one of the lovely ladies that work there. Um, I got the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation and I got it in number six and normally I'm an NC35 for reference. Um, when she swatched me, 
on the side. It felt really good, so I'm pretty much excited to be using this. And she said with this, it's buildable, so if I don't really like wearing foundation. Most of my foundations that I do wear are very light, like the Eclat Matissimi is more of like a tinted moisturizer. There was the other, like I guess, Giorgio Armani line, but it was super lightweight and it was more pink base than yellow base and my skin tone, I'd rather it be more yellow base mm -hmm. than pink base, so this is the reason why I got this. I plan on not really using full coverage because I don't really think I need full coverage. I like my face feeling pretty light, as you guys can see. I like not looking like I have makeup on. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm excited to use this. This is the Shiseido Perfect Foundation Brush. I got a new foundation. Have to try a new foundation brush. Yep. <laughs> so I got this, and it's tiny, so I'm kind of excited about it. But I'm kind of worried about it because I feel like I'm gonna be take I'm gonna take a lot longer applying it. But at least I'm, I'm that'll probably make me buff it out nicer and smoother. Buff it out. <laughs> Right now I'm using the Marc Jacobs foundation brush, and, yeah. I, and I like that too, but I just wanted to try something new because that's what I do. New is fun. <laughs> yeah, new is fun, and it's also my profession. Well, makeup's not my profession, but the beauty industry is my profession, so there you go. gotta try new things, right? Last but not least is this. It's the Caudalie Lip Moisturizer, or Lip Conditioner. Um, I got this at Sephora too. I love this stuff. I use this to prep before I put anything on my lips. It helps keep my lips moisturized throughout, throughout the day. And he uses it too. It's a nice lip balm. Yeah. Yeah. So I think that's all I got. Yep, that's it? Yeah. All that's right. That's it. Now guys, we're going to try. Let's say goodbye now, just in case. So. All right. All right, that's all it right. guys. Thank you very much for watching. And, uh, and thank is... you for being patient, Jesse. Just standing there staring at me while I do Looking my haul. Looking pretty. I'm good. Okay. Thanks mm -hmm. for watching. Goodbye. Bye. Hey guys, we've been shooting a lot of our vlogs, so please check it down below. Click there. Mm -hmm. Click it. Click it. You can click it. Right there. Hey guys, so here we are doing a quick haul with Mookie. Whoop. Look how cute he is. Oh, okay. <laughs> Here! What is this? A King Quest. Insert treats to stimulate natural foraging instincts. Do you have foraging instincts, Mookie? Dog treats! Yum! Catch. There you go. Catch.